Hi, and welcome to this third video in our touch series where we look at conducted immunity. Conducted immunity is essential for robust touch sensing. It's key for a successful touch user interface. Common mode noise is often the cause of poor conducted immunity performance. Common mode noise is commonly generated with power supplies and motors. Without robust touch circuits and touch algorithms, poor conducted immunity performance is the result. Fortunately, there are industry standards that are defined to help test for poor conducted immunity. IEC 61000-4-6 outlines three noise test levels pending the desired usage. For consumer products, level two is advised. For industrial products, level three is advised. Let's see how the WFI32 and the competitive solution perform against these recommended standards. We are back in comparison mode. Um, we made a slight change to our setup here. We are using a simple USB splitter to apply the noise to both boards at the same time. I'm going to turn on the, the noise now. Here's an interesting effect. So what you want to see is nothing, right? Uh, you want to see that all your buttons do not get false triggered and that everything works. Definitely have a false trigger here. All of a sudden we have a slider position and we, the LED turned on. Um, this was another false trigger just by me coming closer to the board. I think you can see this here. The slider is now going backwards, so I'm decreasing volume, but all of a sudden I have a big jump here, so I'm increasing actually. And so you see that we have some noise issues here. So summing up, the WFI32 provides robust sensing under conducted noise to the highest standard of level 3 IEC 61000-4-6. The WFI32 touch sensing does not malfunction like the competitive solution does. Microchip's proprietary circuit and touch library provide superior results in conducted noise environments. Thank you for watching this video and please visit microchip.com WFI32 for more information.